be way, way more inefficient. Like, that one was basically me playing the loops near enough exactly how, as you have to and still not getting any real benefit from it. DS is dead, right, though? Needs buffing, I think. Kappa. We got a uh, shit map again. Biggest map in the game. Damn. Rock in the way. That's new, innit? That rock weren't pushing you like that before. Noted. Same about twice in a row. I'm behaving, innit? That out? No. Oh, there's some people up there. Alright, we should be fine. We should be able to get that. You need my help to get into Oxford University? How the fuck are you going to use... Like, get my help to do that? I don't even know what course you're... Uh, you're studying. Could be something I know nothing about. Oh, nice. Uh, bad hit. Could have got a ninja there, but... Very interesting. I'd rather get injured than uh, get whipped. Hmm. Need to watch out with this guy though. I've missed him twice. He's a bit tricky. There we go. I'm waiting for the dead odds. Can use it. So you might not have it. Because that was like the perfect time to use it. Don't chase the ace. Yeah. Oh. I was thinking that when I was chasing him. It's so deceptive. It's so hard to know which one to go up now. Like, look at that. I can go up that, right? And then this. You can't go up that. Very deceptive, especially when you're like, kind of concentrating. Like in a chase or whatever. My zombies aren't really helping too much because of the map size. That kind of sucks. The zombies can do quite a lot for uh, Nemesis. Uh, appreciate it, uh, Dino, for the two months. Thank you, man. That's one good. Close down. that window. Hmm. Nice. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is definitely feeling more like a solo. Like, these gens are way more realistic. And these chases were longer, by the way, than that last team. That last team I was down in way faster. It's like night and day, man. A way more enjoyable experience. Oh, I hear a gen. I don't know how to get up here though. Oh, it all looks the same. Balance smart. They're smart. Not smart going for this one though, because it gives me a free whip. Now we are uh, max level. So we are actually a bit of a threat now in chase. More angles, more distance, quicker kind of, um, you know, alignment. Not really noticing anything from this game, I thought. I think it's quite a shit perk. But we'll see. My zombies are doing stuff now, I can see it, it's good. So the difference is the ga uh, of gameplay when you go against solo though, compared to Swift. Uh, at least, like, the game actually lasts a while. And it's not just like this massive imbalance. Like, if these guys do a few good chases here and there, it's gonna go more in their favor. It's like more of a more of a tug of war. You're in a good spot, but I, I want to get past. There we go. Like you can play the game a lot more helpfully. I feel when you go against solos. Swift's all about just camping and tunneling. That's one thing I've kind of realized. Like me doing this hook thing. Um, I can go for like hooks and, you know, get consistent wins and draws and things and have close games uh, against solo. But you just have to take bells whenever you go against Swift. To have that um, have that experience, otherwise you have to act like everyone's swift, and then your um, your record will be better, like your wins will be better. But it means that you'll be, have to play like really sweaty, even against teams that you didn't need to do. Do you know what I mean? I've noticed that. Saw so you over there, love, and I'd rather go for you than the jungle gym. Did you go near? Okay. You don't have to, you just do tier 6 or you six sense to, uh, sense of the swift. I sense that last one were a swift, that's why I went back that girl on the hook. It still weren't enough. She had DS and then she got into body blocks. And then they finished the, the, uh, the last two gens in like fucking a minute or something. The whole game was like four or five minutes long. Fucking mess, they didn't do anything impressive either. Like I read their, uh, their looping Pretty much as perfect as I can. Or close to. This is what it is though. Hmm. That guy is playing that loop quite well. It is the uh killer shack though. Killer shack be that way. It was a swift, that last one. You can't ever say 100%, but if it had, like, UI or whatever, it'd confirm what I'm saying. Oh. 
an imbalanced part of DVD, which makes solo survivors have less fun because of how killers need to play versus swift, they don't need to play that worse way versus solo. If they do that, most people dodge swift. Yeah, I mean, like in our red flag. Uh, yes, it is Ark, I would say. But what can you do about that? You can't balance the game towards Swift level because then Soul is a fuck. Close game. Going for hooks, close game. I'm happy that I continued going for hooks um, even after that stupid uh, Swift match. Alright, let's see what happens here. Do we get a win or a draw? Is that this BS loop? Should be able to get a hit on him here, I think. Yeah, definitely. Run that way, interesting. Wait, why are you here? She wanted a flashlight save, I think. I think I get this. She might have dead all though, so what a shout. Oh, she's doing that stupid shit, okay. Yeah, I don't think I noticed a dead hard in this uh, team. All right, there we go. Dub. Very inefficient team. A lot of experience on killer. But went for hook, so it was close game. Um, got too many videos. I think I don't think it would work. Yeah, yeah, you need to watch out with that stuff. Showing. Uh, Showing stupid shit versus bad killers. Like, if you genuinely want to be good at Survivor, it's all about just rushing gens, honestly. A lot of uh, Survivor's kind of skill, or, or whatever you want to call it, strength. It's rushing gens. Rushing gens and being on uh, comms to get body blocks. Compound 33 blade and game afoot together. Um, sure thing, Thongs. Thank you for the thousand bits, mate. Appreciate it. Bamboozle, please. It's an effective build for focusing tunneling, the obsessions, and mindless chases. It's an effective build for focusing tunneling, the obsessions, and mindless chases. Hmm. Quite a bloody, a bloody lot of builds here, guys. Got quite a bloody, bloody lot of builds. Um. Makes sense that the uh, the highest rep. Uh, yeah, I kind of would escape. But I could have killed that person. I just detached. I've gone against this person twice. It's weird. And this person. Unless I grab them before this. Uh, Deathslinger. I was surprisingly non-sweater. 